Hello viewers, this is IT system admin, a complete troubleshooting solution for you. Today in this tutorial, I am going to show you how to fix kernel 32.dll errors in Windows 10 computers. It's a very very important issue, so don't forget to watch full video. The kernel 32.dll file is a 32-bit dynamic link library file used in Windows to handle memory management, input-output operations, interrupts, synchronizations, and process creation. It also exposes most of the Win32-based API to applications and if the file becomes missing or corrupt, the kernel 32.dll not found error skin appears. In this tutorial, I am going to show you how to fix this issue kernel 32.dll errors in Windows 10 computer. Solution number one. Very simple. Sometimes only a restart may solve your issue. Just click on a start menu. Click on power. And just restart your computer hope after restarting your problem is solved if your problem is still persists you have to go for second way the way is in search bar type cmd right click on command prompt and click on run as administrator Command prompt has been opened. Now run the command. Check this. CSK DSK. That means check this. Space slash R. This will check all your system disks. And to complete this process, you have to restart your computer. Now hit enter. Check the next time the system restarts. Just type Y for yes and hit enter. This volume will be checked the next time the system restarts. Okay, I'm not going to restart this right now. I want to execute another command that is SFC system file configurations space scan now. This command will scan and will try to repair all your system files in your computer. Okay, just hit enter. Okay, I did a mistake. I have to use a forward slash before a scan now. Okay, SFC slash scan now. Hit enter. The command is executing. Beginning system scan. This process will take some time. The verification process is started. It will take a long time. Look, verification 100% complete. Okay, now close command prompt and now restart the computer. Look, now fixing C drive, that means your computer operating system drive, stage 2, 70% completed and totally 3% completed and estimated time is mentioned here. It will take a little long time. Now I am logging to my computer. Hope now kernel 32.dll is missing problem has been solved. If your problem is still persists, go for third way. That is replace 
the kernel 32.dll file with new one okay i need to download the kernel 32.dll file from microsoft site i'm going to show you this way open your browser in google chrome type kernel 32.dll and now hit enter open this link www.dllfiles.com scroll down look here there are many kernel 32 files you have to check your computer architecture version then you have to select the proper kernel 32 file from here okay in search bar type system open system information look here the system type is x64 based pc okay i have to download 64 architecture you will also find 60, 32 architecture here but in my case i will download 64 bit architecture dll file okay click on download the file has been downloaded download has been finished okay now click on show in folder now open this kernel 32 folder zip folder close your browser now go to file explorer open file explorer click on this pc now click on c drive click on windows now scroll down and open system 32 folder now just drag and drop kernel 32.dll file to system 32 folder okay now click on replace the file in the destination now i have to check kernel 32 no the kernel 32.dll file is existing here okay now again go to c drive go to windows scroll down sys wow 64 open this folder now again drag kernel 32.dll file to this folder and drop here click on replace click on continue okay now again type kernel 32 hit enter look kernel 32.dll is existing here also 
now close browsers and now click on start menu click on power button and now restart your computer after restarting your computer hope your problem is solved now the error message kernel 32.dll is not showing this is all for today hope this tutorial is helpful for you keep watching for next tutorial thank you very much